do it key of d all right so um the first thing we're going to do is do the one two three four all right so we're talking about that that one d major chord all right now however you want to voice it in my left hand i have the one three and then my right hand I have the five and three now you can voice it any way you want to you know or you know So one, that's why I'm doing it that way. Two, you know, so let's do that way. All right. So our left hand, we have the one, five, and one of D. The one, five, and one of D. You got that? So let's go ahead with our left hand. Let's. I'm telling you, we're jumping right into it. Let's hit this. Uh, now our left hand, one, five, one. Let's hit it ten quarter notes. One, two, three. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You got it. Now, ba ba da. One, two, three. One, two, three. Then three. One, five. All right. So there we have it. So that's the five, one, and three of D. So total, uh, in our left hand we have the one, five, one. Then our left hand we have the five, one, and three. Got it. I'm going to keep my hands here to make sure that we really have it. Again, the left hand, we have one, five, one. Right hand, five, one, and three. Okay. Let's hit this chord, uh, 12 quarter notes. One, two, three. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. I love it. So let's just have some fun right here. And now, do you see what I'm doing there? Now, if you use it with the index finger and your middle finger, and your hand just already just kind of fall there. All right. Now, this is the thing, ladies and gentlemen. Please, I want to encourage us not to get in our heads and trying to be perfect. This is where let's get our reps in, do it several times, um, so that we can, you know, feel good about it, and you know, you can just have it. All right. Um, yeah, I mean, let's just get it in. OK, cool. All right. Remember, reputation is our friend. All right. So don't get overwhelmed and anything like that. All right. So let's do it. Um, so again, ba -ba -da, ba -da, one, two, three, ba -da, one, two, three. All right, you ready? Now you have it. You see me do it. Let's get ahead. Let's let's go ahead and get ten reps in. Ten reps in. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Three, four, five. What up, Dre? Six. Seven, three more, eight, nine, ten. All right, that's ten reps. All right, so that's your one. All right, so we have that. Now we're going to go to the two. The two of D is D, yeah, E. D, E. So we're going to do an E minor chord there. All right. So we have that one major. E minor seven. All right. So our left hand, we're going to do that same thing. One, five, one. That's that E, B, E. E, B, E. Then our right hand, we're going to have the, the minor third. Five, the minor seven, and the minor third which is a G major chord, <laughs> all right? Now, I'm not gonna dive too much in theory today because it's just about us playing. But if, if you see that G major, the relative minor to G major is E minor, and that's the reason why it's the E minor seven, or the relative major to E minor is that G major, ah, which makes that the, the E minor seven, all right? So again, our left hand, we have the one, 
five and one in our right hand, the minor third five, minor seven, and minor third of E. Okay? See that? Now, let's go ahead and hit this. Matter of fact, let's make sure we have our hands here first before we do that. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. Now, while I'm doing, while I'm doing that, you have the chord. One, five, one, minor third, five, minor seven, and minor third. You got it? E minor seven. Let's hit it 12 quarter notes. One, two, three. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Very good. All right, so what do we have? We have the one, two, yeah. Three. So just that, that one over, over the three, the D major over F sharp. All right? So we have F sharp in our left hand. Uh, we have the uh, five in our right hand A. We have the one D. We have the two E. We have the three F sharp. We have the five A. This is the D major chord. Add that two, put that five on, on that A over F sharp. Now, I'm in my left hand, I'm adding that uh, F sharp, D, and E. Or you could say this is an F sharp minor 7, sharp 5. How do we know that? We have the F sharp minor 7. We have the F sharp, the minor 3rd, the flat 7, right? F sharp minor 7. Let's put that 5 in there, right? C sharp. If we sharp, put that minor 3rd in there. If we sharp that 5, making that C, C sharp to D, D major over F sharp or an F sharp minor seven sharp five. Okay. I want to keep my hands here again, make sure that we have it. Okay. All right. So uh, you got it. D, let's explain it, D major over F sharp. So we have F sharp, which is the three. The one, which is the D, both hands. The two, which is E, both hands. The five, which is the A, both hands. Well, right hand octave. And the three, which is F sharp. See that? Yeah, all right. Um, so let's go ahead and hit it, uh, 13 quarter notes 13 quarter notes let's go and one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen all right so we have the one two three Woo! one two three yeah one two Three. Uh huh. Do it again. One, two, three. And then let's go to that four. One, seven, go to that four. The four of D is G, right? So let's do that G major. We're always just doing that G major. Add that two in there. So my left hand, I have the one, five, and nine, or two, which makes it that G sus two. One, five, and nine. Uh-huh. One, five, and nine of G. One, whole step two, whole step three, whole step four, whole step five. Excuse me. One, whole step two, whole step three, half step four, whole step five, whole step six, whole step seven, half step eight, whole step nine. Now, ladies and gentlemen, do you see how I count it? When we count, literally, that unlocks us and gets us where we want to go. All right? So again, that's that G sus two, one, five, and nine, or two. You got it? Now, let's do that G, uh, still that same G major, uh, oh, you know, in our right hand. So we have the five, one, two, three, and five. Now you can always leave that three out if you want to, or the, or the two out. Or you can add the two. 
All right, so this is where, ladies and gentlemen, even though you know we're, we're, we're playing, this is not this way or that way. This is where you literally have the freedom to express yourself how you want to. All right, so let's make sure that we're expressing ourselves. Let's make sure that we're really, you know, having a good time to express ourselves, not to be so uh, stuck or so handcuffed to doing it this way or that way, but to express yourself, to play. All right. Uh, hey, people, I am Edward Wright. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the channel. I hope that you're enjoying this video. If you are, uh, be sure you, you listen. Be sure to do what you already know. You already know. Be sure to like, subscribe and share and subscribe and like. Make sure that you comment. Make sure that you support the channel and let me know. Get in the comments, get in the chat. Um, you know, all that good stuff. All right. Also, uh, let's be aware that, hey, I do have a Patreon. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The Patreon. The Patreon. Uh, the Patreon.com slash Edward Wright, where this is where you can go and uh, become and support where all of my lives are available and stay available in the Patreon. All right. So go and support. Thank you so much. Um, and, uh, yeah, so, 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 you know, get a part of it. All right. Um, yeah, so let's get into it. So we have that one, two, three, four. Oh. You know what? Let's pause for a moment and just practice that. So what am I practicing that that appreciate of that G sus two? Well, G sus two or a D sus four. <laughs> All right. So you can think we can think of it as a D sus four. D sus four meaning one four five one of D. Okay. Or you can think of it as a G sus two one two and five, and it would be starting on that D. All right. So both are correct, but we would use it as a G. Because if we do that chord, you know. So what am I doing? I'm starting with that five, one, two, five, five, one, two, five, five, one, two, five, five, one, two, five. All right. Now, as we are doing this, I want to encourage us to try. Do not be afraid of making a mistake, but go ahead and try. Just put your hands to it. And let's play music. Let's play. All right. Um, so let's do it. Okay. So um, let, let's do that. Um, let's get like 10 reps in. One, two, three. Let's go. One, two, three, again. 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 Two more times. Let's go. Last time, 
Here we go, and. All right. Now again, ladies and gentlemen, add that in your playing. Also take that same exercise and just, you know. stretch out now i will we will we will do that later on but you gotta wait until we're ready for that you gotta wait because i'm not we're not gonna get in that today all right this is where you spend your time and practice and and enjoy yourself and play like i mean really have a good time and play or discover the instrument and just have a good time all right um so it's important that we again we play even though we're in the key of g we're still working out in what I mean, excuse me, we're in the key of D, and we're still working out in G because G is the four of D, right? Uh, matter of fact, come on, let's do some theory. Hey, Kia Bella, how are you? Uh, so let's talk about the key of D, right? What is the five of D? What is the five of D? D. A. Lit literally, ladies and gentlemen, count D E F. G A. A is the five of D. What is the three of D? D E F. It is F. What kind of F is it? F sharp. D E F sharp. How do we know that? One D. Whole step E. Whole step three F sharp. E, see it in our mind. Where is the E on the piano? Bam, that's E, right? White note. If you go up a whole step, the, a whole step from E will be the next black note, would be F sharp. It will be F sharp and not G flat because every letter of the musical alphabet has to be represented. Because you know the two is E, the three is going to be F, so it'll be F sharp. Let's go to the piano and make sure that's correct. So you have D, one, whole step two, E, whole step three, F sharp. We see that? One, two, three, one, whole step two, whole step three, A. 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 A. One, whole step two, whole step three, A. One, whole step two, whole step three, A. You got it. One, whole step two, whole step three. Come on, you already got it. All right, so let's go back to where we where we were. One. Uh, three, uh, four. Now, just from those four chords, you can do so much. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One. There's so many different verses you can do. Look at that G major nine. So what do I have in my left hand? One, five, and seven. Then I have the nine, three, and five. Take that. Take it. Take that voicing. G major nine. You see it? Let's go ahead and take this voicing. I mean, take it. Let's hit it 15 quarter notes. One, two. Three, let's go 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. You got it. There it is. I love it. All right, so we have the one. Right? 
So that's where I want to challenge us to get to. Now, what we're going to do now, we're going to play each chord for four beats. So like one, two, three, four, and then move that way. All right. Are you enjoying this session? If you are, be sure to like, share, subscribe, comment. Let me know. All right. So that what? We can all grow and, and enjoy each other and enjoy our conversation and, and all of that stuff. You know, don't don't be selfish. Don't do it like, you know, come on. All right. All right, so let's get a a click a a, a click track. Hey, so four beats. All right, so one, two, three, D major chord. One, two, three, E minor seven. One, two, D over F sharp. One, two, G major chord. One, two, three. Again, D major chord, two, three, E minor seven, one, two, three, D over F sharp, two, three, G major seven chord, G major nine, you got it, one, and one, two, three, E minor, two, three, D over F sharp, two, three, four. You got it again and one, two, three, four. E minors. Uh-huh. D over F sharp. Four. Got it. Two, three, four. Oh, you know, let, let's do that. A. So all that is A. So what do we have? The G in our left hand, the A major chord, second inversion in our right hand. We have the five, one, three of A. Now go to G. Uh huh. Do it again. And one, two, three, four. We're going to do it a few reps so that you can make sure you have it. All right? Uh huh. Again. And. Yep. Got it. Come on, do it again. And one, two, three, four. One, two, do it again. Let's go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three more times. And one, two, three, four. Good. Two more. Let's go. Good. Last time, let's go. All right? And just put it in your plane, you know. Three, four. You see it? Two, four, one. See? So this is the thing. Ladies and gentlemen, we literally can can change the order instead of just going one, two, three, four. You can say one, three, two, four, or one, four, two, three. You you really, for real, for real, have total freedom. So this is not about you doing it this way or that way. It's really just about you discovering and having fun in D. All right? So, I, you know, and, and again, we're only taking the first four scale degrees. One, two, three, and four. We're not trying to do everything. We're just taking those first four chords of that D major scale that, you know, in the key of D. So, I, I, again, I want to stress uh, that you can do this. <laughs> that you are more than able, that you are more than capable of what? 
doing it. You are more than you are more cap you are more than capable of being successful, right? Now listen, it is May uh, first. Today is May first. Uh, even for those of us who may watch this replay, and it may be, but it's May first. So listen, know that. This first day of May, you can do whatever you put your mind to, that you are more than capable of, of any obstacle that stands in your way. And we're just using music as an example. This is just a, 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 an example or a tool to you know, hope, hopefully uh, remind us that we are amazing, that, that there's nothing that we can accomplish. All right, so repeat after me. I am confident. I am amazing. I am secure. I don't second guess myself. I don't second guess myself. I love me. I embrace me. I don't run away from challenges, but I face them. I am confident. You are. <laughs> All right. All right. Uh, now, let's go ahead and, and, and get back into it. Uh, now, again, we're going to keep our, uh, our, 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 get our track going again. Remember, we're going to start off slow. We'll, we'll probably start off playing each chord, maybe eight beats to make sure that we get it and then build up our speed and go from there. All right. Thank you so much for your participation and cooperation. Be sure to like, share, comment, support the channel. All right. Um, yeah. One, two, hit that one. Let's go. D major. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, E minor, seven, one, two, three. D over F sharp. G major nine. Yeah, let's do it again on that one. Two. Three. F sharp and four. Yeah, two, three, uh, two, E minor. Let's go. Uh huh. All right, do that D over F sharp to that three. All right, go to that four. And this time, all right, let's make it up faster. Just four beats. Let's go. And one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, again, and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, again, and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, 
four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right, now this time we'll do it with two beats. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Again, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, again. And one, two, three, four. One, two, three. All right, quarter notes. Ready? Let's go. One, two, three, A. Try new things, you know, and uh, you know, express yourself. And even if it doesn't sound good, express yourself, you know. Try some new things. Let's close out right there. Come on. And. Just keep on moving on it. Let's go. And. You got it. Do it again. Let's go. You got it. Do it again. Let's go. You got it, do it again. Let's go. You got it last time, here we go. Yeah. All right. Now, how, how do you feel? You feel good? I hope so. All right, well, ladies and gentlemen, hey, that's been our session today. I just wanted to get in. It's a fun 30 minute or so session in the key of D. We're doing the one, two, three, and four of D. All right, if you've enjoyed this session, be sure to like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Also, again, check out the Patreon, um, you know, uh, and all that good stuff. If you've enjoyed the channel, if you've enjoyed the show, uh, support. All right, your cash app is right there. Thank you so much. Uh, the Patreon is right there. Thank you so much. Also, if you would hit that Zale up, it's right here. All right. Thank you so much. Um, so, uh, listen, y'all know what to do. Show your love, show your support. And um, y'all know what it is. All right. I will see you later. Peace. <laughs>